No players found, yeah. Maybe I can go back and do some of the fighting with Goku. <laughs> course the following would be applied when you okay well, if I really wanted to I could go through the the character thing again and create the character and fight again oh this is frustrating because I've I want I just wanted to come home and play this Unfortunately, I work tomorrow. Oh, wait. I don't know if he said this before or not. Hey! Hey! Uh, God damn you, Trunks. Disappointed, it throws everyone online instead of giving you a menu screen. Yeah, I mean, what if you just wanted to play in an offline mode? You know, they should have that. Because from what I see, it's not only a single player game, but it's a multiplayer game, so why not have two individual things not, like, coincide? Yeah, dude, I, I, in the last week, we lost somebody at work, so I'm, like, working more hours now. Getting, not getting paid what I should be getting paid, because he was a manager, and I'm doing shit that the manager should be doing half the time. And then, two, my car died on me because of how cold it's been. Hey, transporters. Yeah. And can't even access the fucking time capsules. Well, if you want to, man, uh, hit that follow button. So maybe in the future, you know, you can uh, watch me play other games as well as this whenever it happens. One thing that I would like would say, like, I'm surprised that it wouldn't let me upgrade my character. It just automatically leveled me up, didn't even let me pick any skills or any uh, points to spend anywhere. Oh, it is rough, man. Uh, the car, I mean, I've had for like 12 or 13 years, and it's been good to me, but it could be a, a computer in the engine, it could be a relay switch, it could be an ignition, um, or it could be a... What was the other thing? An alternator, but I get power, so I'm thinking it's probably ignition or a relay, and if it's ECU, that's going to be expensive. So, you know, I don't know. It almost reminds me of a PS2 game or a PS1 game where the character, or actually a Nintendo game, where the characters will say one thing and then they won't, you know, they'll say hi or what's up and then the rest of it's text. Do you think in this day and age they can actually provide audio? Fucking looks hey. like fucking Yamcha over here. There is a section you can upgrade, because it said, um, play data? Uh, customize. Yeah, there we go. Um, change equipment. Well, at least you can go back and you're not stuck with, with the shit that you had before. A Z-so? Okay, then. Oh, okay, there we go. Super attack. Full power energy blast volley. Super front jump. Boost attributes. Okay, there we go. Max stamina. Oh, 
Well, at least it keeps that. We can actually do caps of nice health, key, stamina, stat. Okay. Kind of what I've always wanted in a Dragon Ball Z game, though, where you can actually level up. Now, if they could only uh, allow you to level up like in a hyperbolic time chamber or something, that would be amazing. It really has the uh, the feel of a... Uh... Oh, thanks for the follow, man. Much appreciated. Okay, it is working. Addition to starting to work. You haven't seen him when you tried, okay. So, what do you think? Like, um... How old are you? How long have you been following the Dragon Ball Z franchise? I, I think uh, GT hey. sucked like many people did, but hey. there were some aspects of GT I liked. Hey. Um, Dragon Ball Z Battle of Gods was pretty damn good. Welcome. I mean, they really did a lot with vendors and stuff. I, I've only only looked at a little bit of the game, and most of it was in Japanese, and you just saw the, the the historic fights. You didn't get to see any of this other stuff, and it amazes me that they did go this far. Yeah, I followed um, the original Dragon Ball here and there when I was growing up, and then I uh, got into Z, and then Z was on for three years, and then for some reason the channel that Z was on at this time, I think it was like the CW, but it was on there before it was called the CW, and then for whatever reason they dropped it. And then um, Adult Swim Cartoon Network picked it up. And then, you know, nothing happened, you know, until GT came out. And one thing with Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball GT, we were all always like 10 years behind what came out in Japan. For the longest time, this was my favorite anime. And then I... Uh, did Bleach. Sir. Uh, Bleach was an amazing series, and then I got into other other anime, like Darker Than Black, and um, what was the other one <laughs> that I got into, and it was pretty good. Um, of course, yeah, 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 um, the one with the robots, fuck. Um, Gundam. Especially the one with the dark Gundam. Greetings. Um, that was a good, good franchise. Now I watch any anime that's on, that's English dubbed. I can't, can't follow sub. There's too much that goes yeah. on. Especially Dragon Ball Z or Bleach. If you try to, like, read subtitles. Oh, you got energy capsule. Okay, well, I got something. You cannot go beyond this point yet. Well, at least, like, somebody gave me something. Hello, welcome to the stream. Um, it looks like a lot of the features on this game are actually down at the moment, so I'm just kind of going around seeing what I can do. I could always create another character and just go through the... Um, the game again just to fight, but... It's not like it's a real fight because all the enemies only have like one bar of health. Yep. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, that sucks, man. By the time the DBZ got to the Boo Saga, it turned to Spanish. Um, well, you should be able to watch all all, all of the all the sagas on online at some point. Different websites. Yo. Yeah, there's a lot of people that prefer you know Japanese. Uh, now, if if I if I understand. Okay, did not realize that was that. Okay. If I understood Japanese, I wouldn't have a problem with it, but trying to read subtitles with how fast the action is in some anime is just fucking too damn much. Oh, you did get the capsule too? Was that before or just recently you got it? How are you? You know, instead of giving you a capsule, you think they'll give you a sensu beam. Yeah, there wasn't broadband nearly the way that you got lucky. Like, that was one of the few animes where I actually bought so DVDs for. Now it's like there's no point of buying anime DVDs unless you're just really hardcore into anime. Vegeta. Did you just say Vegeta? What the fuck? Vegeta. Yeah, it sounds like he does say Vegeta. Vegeta. <laughs> so I don't think you said did you get to watch Dragon Ball Z Battle of Gods yet? It was my first anime I ever saw in a theater. Naruto and Jap. See, the one thing with with some animes, I don't have a problem reading the sub because they're not doing anything, so, you know, sitting down, talking, eating, or, you know, just having a conversation. But Bleach, Dragon Ball Z, when they're sitting there and they say like two or three words, you get a whole paragraph of text to read and then it goes away. And then other stuff, they'll say like 20 words, you get two words on sub and then it's up there for like 45 seconds you watch it like five times I, I think what they're trying to do with the, the new movies coming out and then the revival of Frieza's coming out in Japan this year um, I, I think they're trying to totally redo Dragon Ball for a new franchise to get people that were into it back into it and to get new people that are into anime into it for the first time. And they, they want to totally disregard GT and just move off the events of Dragon Ball Z. And This, this was a game I was hoping that they would... Um, um, What's up? Do a whole new storyline. Stop going off through the storyline that has already been in the games like 10 times and create an individual story. And I'm glad that they linked the events of, of, of gods along with the new story. Yeah, for not having one in so long. You get so used to it. <laughs> you develop the skill. Uh, I'm just your typical lazy American, I guess. Welcome. It'd be nice if at least I could go into a training simulation. 